Trace we had here at Springfield. He's in position to do it again. Rispoli lines him up, coming off a of turn four, getting a really good drive, pulls up alongside. As they fan out full wide, going into turn one. Loud of the lead. Man, that's the way to get revenge. If you don't like what Barnes did in the start, they shove him back to fourth. But look at him working on that 68 of the high line to get it back. Going to be two to go here. This is anybody's race at this point. Chad Coase at the front. Ben Lau going up around the outside. Barnes down to the inside. Rispoli looking for a hole through the middle. Barnes might have this. He does. He goes from fourth to first in a little less than a lap. But he got Lau down to the inside of the 25. This is going to be a phenomenal finish. Wow. White flag out. One lap to go. They go four wide again. This is anybody's race. Who's going to who's gonna want it the most? Well, Coase is the only one of this four-pack that has not won a race this year, and he's in the lead right now. But is the lead where you want to be? I don't think so. Okay. Rispoli lines him up coming off a of turn two, getting a good draft down the back straightaway. CB, it doesn't appear to have anything, at least at that part. Yeah, but he's still... Oh, no, he does now. Wow. Wow. James Rispoli buries it through the middle of three and four. All right, so he's got the lead coming out of four. Here comes Lau. Here comes Barnes. Here comes the draft. But it's going to be James Rispoli holding on for the win. That was a perfect turns three and four. Rispoli's only chance really to win that one was to create enough separation and hope they went side by side, and that's what happened. And the fans, we are not packed like we normally are here in 2020, but they respect that race and they love to see that Harley Davidson's taking the win and Raspoli has his second victory of the season. Here's the pass. Yeah, Raspoli back a little ways. Coast opens up a little hole. Raspoli says, yeah, I'm just going to fill this gap and run it as hard as I can. And these guys are fighting for position to get in behind and pull on the draft, but nobody really lines up behind him. Raspoli to the line. Great race. Uh, this guy's always so fun to talk to. Let's send it to Kristen. James Raspoli's second win in the 2020 season. James, it seemed as though you just had a little more corner speed than the rest of them. Where'd you find it? Well, dude, we, me and Chad, right off the first start, we're like just dancing, doing the old Aprilia duo on, a, a new, on our a new Harley Davidsons. And back in the day, me and Chad used to do that and, and blitz away. We said that we were going to try to do that. But once I saw six guys come underneath me, I'm like, oh boy, it's an hour race. So we, it was kind of just staying in the, in, in the top three most of that race. I was watching Barnes, watching Ben, and kind of using their bikes to my advantage. You know, after yesterday, I wasn't gonna lay down and just let this happen, you know? We're in a championship fight, we need to respond with wins. And I was happy with taking the podium, but dude, I'm just so pumped. Thank you so dude, much. Dude, <laughs> oh, Let's go. <laughs> oh. How about that, the team? Harley guys, obviously getting along. That was Coach coming up to congratulate Raspoli. Lau splits them though. He finishes second and Barnes so close to sweeping the doubleheader fourth. I'm exhausted. Man, that was fabulous. I sure hope Super Twins is as good. <laughs>